What's up guys, Perry from Rockville here, and today I'm gonna show you how to set up your UT Bag 10. So as you can see, it comes with the bag itself, and inside of the bag, you'll also see this strap here that we can attach. So to attach the strap to the bag, all we have to do is clip on the hooks here on this strap, to the hooks here on each side of the bag. We can even adjust the length of this strap to make it as long or as short as we need. If we look at the bottom of the bag, you'll see these rubber spikes here so we can safely place our bag onto any floor or surface. We even have these straps here to carry the bag by hand and we can join them together by using this Velcro here. So now let's take a look at each pocket for the bag. So right here we have the front pocket that we can open up with this zipper here. And right away you'll see that each side has their own pockets that we can use. So we can use this pocket here for bigger items like iPads, laptops, etc. And then we have multiple pockets here. So we have this mesh pocket here that's see-through. We even have these little pockets here that are great to use with tools such as screwdrivers, flashlights, Allen keys. You can also put your pens and pencils in these. And then we have this pocket here for medium size items like measuring tape, hard drives, etc. So then we can use the zipper to close the pocket up when we're done. And the cool thing about these zippers is that we can run a padlock through the middle for extra security. Now, if we take a look at the main pocket, you'll see all of these dividers here, which is great to use with our cables to keep them nice and organized inside. You'll also notice that half of these dividers are stitched into the bag, while the other half of these dividers are Velcroed, so we can even take them out to make more room for bigger items to place inside. So to do that, you're just gonna rip each pocket out like so. This divider right here has a zipper so we can place things inside, which is really cool. Once we have the dividers out, we can place our items inside, like this light, for example. And while they're detached, we can also use these dividers to keep our items nice and snug. So I have one here, and I can even fold it in half, place it any way I see fit to keep my items secure, and I can place these dividers either on the sides, on the top, or on the bottom. To reattach the dividers, all we're gonna do is line up the Velcro here on the sides of the dividers to the Velcro here on the sides and the bottom of the bag, just like this. So like I mentioned, we can take our cables and place them inside of each divider. And you can really place any type of cables inside of these dividers. So they can be XLR, quarter inch, HDMI, ethernet, IEC for power. You can also place other items inside like your power strips, extension cables, gaffers tape, and much more. We also have all of these pockets here that we can use. So we have these transparent ones so we can place our driver's license, credit cards, business cards, etc. We also have this pocket here that we can use to place our smartphones or chargers. And then we also have these mesh pockets so we can place our chargers, guitar picks, really anything you want. Once you're all done, you can close it up with a zipper, which also has the holes in the middle so we can run the padlock through. We've also got this strap on the back of the bag, which we can use to strap the bag onto a trolley handle to roll it along with the rest of our gear. Lastly, we have these pockets here on each side of the bag that have a fair amount of room for microphones, guitar pedals, smartphone or tablet holders, and much more. So hopefully this showed you guys how easy it is to set up your UT Bag 10, but of course if you have any questions, comments, or concerns, feel free to reach out to our customer support team through phone or email. As always, I'm Perry from Rockville, and we'll see you guys next time.